I've heard your requests and the original Team Hood shirt is back on sale forever. This Team Skull inspired shirt has three different designs to choose from. The link to the store is on screen and in the description. How's it going everybody? Welcome to some more Pokemon Solar Light and Lunar Dark. This is of course part 12, not 13. Part 12. If you guys are enjoying the series thus far as much as I am, then go ahead and leave a like on the video for me. It's greatly appreciated. If you are not caught up with the series and you want to be caught up, there's a playlist link in the description. Please, please, please click on the playlist uh, and ch check out check out the, vi the, the other videos, man. You know, the playlist has got you sorted. Playlists are the new wave. However, got, got some games to play. Uh, I don't actually know where I am. I forgot because uh, I only record this twice a week. So bear with me. Uh, we have, okay, right, we gotta go north. Right, okay, and we're gonna be getting a dragon egg. So hopefully this other egg that we have on our, our team gets hatched hatched soon. Uh, Jeff will be, will be evolving this episode, I think. So that's exciting, we're gonna see what Jeff evolves into. Uh, but yeah, for the most part, I guess we're just gonna go with the flow. See, uh, see where the wind takes us. Uh, I don't actually know if there's much I need to do here. Uh, I guess I'll just explore. Oh heck, a dawn stone or a dusk stone, I don't... I don't know which one's more useful for me. Um, I'm gonna say Dawn, I, I guess. Oh heck, there he is, it's the boy. Ah, uh, it's you, you wimp, long time no see. So you're here gonna head in Jurassic City. I told you, it's my hometown, it's no place for a weakling like you. I'm going there too, and I'm going to battle Rex. He's one of the elite four. If I can beat him, I'll be one of the best trainers in Rokoto. But first, how about we battle? I want to test that menu Pokemon. Okay, all right, his music is actually so flames. What the hell is a frog goo? Uh, that, that literally just looks like my starter Pokemon, but like bigger. Wait, what? I'm so lost right now. That literally that actually just looks like my starter Pokemon. I forgot I'm ridiculously over leveled in this game. Who the hell is this, bro? Whoa. Did the, is that what the little, uh, the, his starter Pokemon evolves into? I don't, Dino Pi, Dino Pion? I don't really like how he looks. He looks weird. Steel Gus Steel. Yo, this guy is actually a dinosaur collector. I just, it just occurred to me. This guy just likes dinosaur Pokemon. I don't know why that didn't... That didn't really... That didn't really occur to me before. Wait, what? That thing's a flying type? Huh? Wait, why did Earthquake... What? Uh, what? Wait, 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 what? Oh, he's got, he's got, he's got tiny ass wings. He, I guess he does, wow. And he just one-shot Siphoon. Okay, Cast Spring. Uh, okay, never mind, we're good. I'm still better. That's what you always say, bro. Uh, I guess these new Pokemon need more training. I reckon I can find myself strong Pokemon in the ancient past. To get to Rassic City, you have to get through there. You should come to Rassic City, I think. You shouldn't come to Rassic City. I think you're too weak for this city. Catch you later, loser. How could somebody be so adamant that I'm weak, even though they just constantly lose to me? It just, it just makes no, no, no goddamn sense. Okay, so apparently uh, Professor Pinewood is waiting for us at the Pokemon Center. Cool, got some story stuff to get on with then. What's all this then? Oh, you made it. Come have a seat. All right, if I have to. This reminds me of Diamond and Pearl, man. I have to tell you the information I found about the two organizations known as Team Solar and Team Lunar. I already told you, Solar and Lunar are searching for the Elemental Stones. Five stones belong to the Elemental Pokemon of Rokoto. Legend has it that these stones trapped Solran, a uh, Pokemon of Order, and Lunaro, the Pokemon of Chaos, in another dimension. This sounds like Sun and Moon, man. Other dimension? Like Ultra Wormholes and stuff? I remember this story my dad told me when I was a little kid. He told me that all five stones were united. It would open the portal to this dimension and release Solran and Lunaro back into our world. That's correct, Kira. If they succeed in their mission, they will release Solran and Lunaro back into our world where they will fight once again, destroying everything in their way. Core stone safe uh, from them at all costs. Team Lunar already has the Earth Stone and Team Solar already has the Vault Stone. That leaves two last stones out there. Uh, my research led me to believe uh, somewhere named near Rainbow Reef and Whispers Tunnel. Okay, but you need to keep it safe. At the moment, I have a word. Both teams are near Jurassic City. Uh, they must be after something there. May I request that three of you head over Jurassic City and see what they're doing? Okay, cool, cool, cool. Is 
Is it dive? Oh, what? Salasalamite. Oh, it's a rare stone called Mega Stone. When you're a specific Pokemon, it reacts in some way with it. That's the other reason I'm sending you through Jurassic City. There's a specialist of Mega Stones. Lizzie, you should show her this. I think she could help you find out how it works to react with your Pokemon. Our starter Pokemon can Mega Evolve? I deadass didn't know Mega Evolution was in this game. Holy crap. I love Mega Evolution. This is so cool. I'm really excited. So I guess I'm just gonna go ahead and give it to Salah Slam right now. I don't imagine it works yet because we don't have a Mega Bracelet. Uh, but hey, that's pretty cool. Mega Evolution, guys. Now I can put Mega Evolution in the title and thumbnail. What the hell is this, Whaley? Why is this actually better designed than Wilmer? Like genuinely, this is a better design than Wilmer. Wilmer is Wilmer's a bad Pokemon. Whoa, Squidart. He's got like little uh, warning symbols on him. He's actually really cool too. Whoa, 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 whoa. I didn't sign up for all that. Oh my god, I didn't know that was a current. Oh jeez, Rick. I don't know if I'm going the right way anymore. <laughs> ancient pass. Here we are. Here we are. This is where uh, passes are ancient. Uh, I've been watching The Chilling Adventures of Sabrina a lot on Netflix recently. Very good show. I don't know why I brought that up. I guess Ancient Pass kind of just reminds me of that. Oh, it's you. What are you doing here? Never mind. This is the Ancient Pass. You gotta get through to get to Rastic City. It's a breeze for me. I used to play in here when I was a kid. I can get through it with ease. I'm gonna find Rex and beat him. I'll prove what it takes to be the best. Catch you later. Huh. I thought he was maybe gonna ask me to walk with him, but apparently not. Okay. Well, hopefully it's... Not too annoying, because I really don't like caves that much. <gasps> oh my god, it's this thing! I really wanted one of these! Oh, what type are you? Whoa, what is that animation? Chill! What type are you? A ghost rock type. Oh, that's so cool. Does this thing evolve? Oh, apparently it does. At level 40, it evolves. It evolves into spec stone. I don't really like the name of that one, but... Man, that thing's really cool! Oh, I kinda wanna use it. There's nothing better than a walk through the ancient pass. I could think of a lot of things, actually, but, you know, to each their own. Oh, Jewel Tall. Who's this guy? He's he's kinda crazy looking. He reminds me of, like, a ninja -ask, but with, like, Gucci on or something. Yo, Com- Com- Cosmet? It's like a- it's like a better version of Minier, dude. This thing's hella cool. God, I wish I had a Blitz of Glow still. Look how- look how- innocent and cool he looks a lot of you guys were like confused that's why i liked him so much honestly i don't know i just like middle, middle evolutions okay he reminds me of crash bandicoot as well and i love i love crash bandicoot <laughs> hey look it's these guys hey man how you doing no signs of team solo or team lunar maybe they're not here uh but in jassic city like the professor mentioned i mean or rasic rasic glad you came have you seen anyone from these weird teams no Oh, literally bumped right into us. Really, really coincidentally. That's really... Those, uh, you guys again? Did you see a guy just now with spiky hair run through here? Who is he? He went running that way. Move out of the way. Oh. Is that like a childhood friend of his or something? Maybe Rick needs help. I hate to say it, but we should follow them. Maybe that guy's a part of Solar or Lunar. Could be right, Kira. Let's go. Wow, what's going on here? Got some, got some spicy tea, guys. Got some... That's uh, wild encounters. Hey Rex, I'm Rick, the brother of Jurassic City's Dragon Master Lizzie. Challenge you to a battle. Lizzie's brother. Ah, yes. Rich, was it? No, it's Rick. Oh, sorry, but I'm in a hurry. I have no time to talk. No, I want a battle right now. I'll show you my fa I, I, I will show my family. No, show everyone that I'm strong enough to beat you. I really don't have the time, but how about this? You go battle your sister, and if you beat her, I will happily accept your challenge. Right, so this is Rex. Okay, he's looking cool. Huh, who are you three? Never mind. I have no time to talk. I'm searching for some people in strange uniforms. Have you seen anyone like that around here? Team Solar and Team Lunar? Well, you've heard of them. Yes, we encountered them a few times when Professor Pinewood sent us here to look for them. Um, really? Then he has to trust you. Will you help me find them, please? Wow, we're gonna help Rex. I bet Rick's really jealous. Oh, right, they're up here. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, my God. What is that? We both have what we want, so how about you? And your little minions disappeared, Derek. We may both have the crystals we need, but you have the vault stone and we need of it. Hand it over now. Haha, <laughs> do you really think I would just hand it over because you asked? And who do you think you're talking to? Do you really think I would be stupid enough to bring it here with us? I thought you were smarter than that, Derek. Never mind. We have what we came for. Um, but be sure, Starla, this isn't the last time we meet. Damn, okay. 
These are these are the main these are these the main guys or or I've never seen these guys before. They're like the main villains, right? What are you doing here? Who are you? Uh, Rex, the Elite Four, what do you want? He's got those meddling brats with him. Uh this will be easy. There are more of us. Uh let's take them out. Um, this is where you kids meet your end. Are they really gonna work together? They want a battle, we'll give them one. You four help me out, battle the commanders, I will deal with the two leaders. Oh, right, so they are leaders. So I got I gotta take on Gloria. Right, okay. Is there a version because this is solar light and lunar dark? Is there like a way I can make it so I'm taking on, on the lunar dark people? Because I think I've always been taking on like the solar people, mainly. I don't know. I don't know how this game works. Is it depending on the star you choose? How, how does it work? Dear Inferno, oh my god, look at his final evolution! He's so sick! Our order will rule over Rukoto. Okay, cool, man. Shiba Kid's really making me mad. It's not important if we win or lose. We have a legendary, the legendary crystals. Uh, that was one of the only... Time we will help you, Team Lunar. Now we will uh, get all the five elemental stones together and revive Solran and bring our new order to the region. Uh, I will make sure you don't get that far. We will get the stones and Lunaro will bring our chaos. This is not the end. Our mission will succeed. Smokescreen. Okay. Take more than a member of Elite Four or some brats to stop our plans. Flash. Okay, bye. This isn't good. Yo, why is Rex like. Why does it. Why does he go like. Why, why does his eye look like that, bro? We still beat them, but what are those crystals? What are they talking about? We may have won the battle, but we haven't stopped our plans. The crystals, we shouldn't talk here. I'll head back to Rassic City. Meet me there in the ancient museum. I'll tell you why I know about them there. But first, what's the, what is that? They didn't take this crystal. They might, they must not think it's important, but I think it may be useful to us. There's nothing more you can do now. Thank you for all your help. Very talented trainers. Maybe one day we will battle at the Rokoto League Village. Wait, what? Village? A battle. That's what I want. I don't care about the Siri Crystals and these stupid organizations. I will beat you, Rex, and I will show you the world how strong I am. I will go defeat my sister and then I will show you, Rex. Right, so his sister... His sister's a gym leader or something? He really has fire in him. Again, thank you for your help. Wait a second until love your Pokemon. Thank you! Whoa, what's this? Mr. Blet? It's like, I don't even, what am I looking at, man? Are you kidding me? Yo, I just found a shiny Dracubat. On complete accident. Uh, I don't know what type it is. So I, how do I weaken it? I got, last time I used Jeff to weaken something, I one shot it, but I think it should be okay this time. That's really cool though, actually. Okay, well, Jeff lived on 1 HP, so that's cool. Don't kill it. Jeff, are you kidding me? I mean, I wasn't going to use it anyway. And shinies are fairly common in this game. Jeff has got some strong teeth on him, bro. Wingon. Oh my god, look at him. He reminds me of Salamence. He's so goofy. I love him. I want him. Oh my god, he's great. Oh, here we are in Rassic City. Dope, we made it. Made it through the ancient past. That was an intense battle against those Team Solar and Lunar guys. Wonder what's up with the Crystal Rex took. Maybe he can use it to stop those teams? Rex said they meet us at the ancient museum. That's a big building south of us. First we agreed to battle. Ah, oh, of course. I need to battle more. Okay, let's battle. Ah, he's got Leonite still. Leonite looks dope actually. But it does I don't think it evolves. And I, I don't really like Pokemon unless they can evolve. Whoa, it's Babel! Wow, it's the- is that the water one? I think it looks cool. I like him. Funky. Yeah, most of these Pokemon are stuff we've seen before. Hmm, another loss for me. Let me heal your Pokemon. Thanks, man. Moving to the ancient museum now. Should come too. Rex is waiting for us. See you in a bit. Oh, hey, here he is. Hey, Rex. Here you are. Please come this way. My friend's already waiting for you. Uh, the scientist here it's next to me is Sean. He specializes in ancient artifacts and he knows a lot about the history of Rokoto. Crystals are connected to the legendary Pokemon Sylvan and Lunaro. Uh, they are formed when they are born. We believe the crystals hold a special power and energy, if you will. This energy grants power to Solran and Lunaro, making them stronger. They already are. It's like a battery. The who holds crystals of sun and moon holds the power to command order and chaos. That must be why they wanted those crystals. So now that they have those crystals, they can control the legendary Pokemon. That's what the myth suggests. So this isn't good news. If they manage to release Solran and Lunaro back into the world, they can control them like puppets. Since two different sides hold a crystal, there will be nothing but disaster. Solran and Lunaro are matched in power. There will be no end. This is terrible, but Rex, 
uh, the balance crystal. The crystal has a purpose. We just don't know what its purpose is. Perhaps it can help in some way. We have our scientists working on it and figuring out what I can do. I knew it'd be important. I'm glad those teams overlooked it. We can stop them. We're already winning. Axel has the core stone, so they don't they don't know that. Keep that stone. I trust it will be safe in your hands for now. I've got a feeling something's bad gonna happen with the stone with me. God damn it. Hopefully I can figure out how the balance crystal works really soon. The only thing I know is that I have to stop team solar and lunar. First, I have to go to the castle and battle the Castellian Lizzie. You should do the same, Axel. As I said, I'm not battling Lizzie. I'm afraid of dragon types. What the hell? I'm going to go to Green Pine for my next badge. Professor Pinewood also said he will be there. You know, he's a gift for us. See you in Green Pine. Bye. Okay, well, I guess. Uh, is, is she the gym leader? I don't I don't even know, man. Oh, hey, Lugo is. It's our favorite guy. Home sweet home. Okay, this is his home. Good to know. That's great, dear. I'm pleased to hear you're doing well. Sure, you can beat Rex if you want to. Oh, who's this? I just walked into his house, bro. I can't imagine how mad he is. This is Axel. I met him in Serpentine City. He's competing in gym badges too. We've battled a few times. Arrival, that's cool. I'm going to win the Rokoto League. Even if Axel is in it, you'll see. Oh, wait, is this his sister? Wow, look who it is. You should battle your sister before taking on the Elite Four, don't you think? Oh, Lizzie, of course. Mom and Dad told me that you started your journey in competing in gym badges and battles. That's great. Uh, but... Just because we're related doesn't mean I'll go easy on you in a battle. I expect nothing less. Then come to Rasio Castle. Let's see if you're able to defeat me. All right. I'll have to do some quick training session. Then I will battle and beat you. Axel, don't think you've even signed a chance against my sister. So I'm a little brother. He feels like he needs to prove himself. He thinks he's always just in my shadow because I run the castle. I'm an expert with po uh, Mega Evolutions. Oh, she's the Mega Evolutions lady. Okay. Professor Pine, we told you about an expert in Mega Evolutions. Oh, what's that? Oh, that's the Salislamite. Um, but you don't know how to use it. <laughs> All right, I'll teach you how to use it. But first, you have to battle me in the Rasso Castle. Ugh, oh, okay, fine, fine, fine. And I guess here's the castle. So I guess we can get Mega Evolution soon. Hell yeah. Is this a gym? It's an unofficial gym. Ah, of course. Faily. Yo! Oh my god, there's so many cool dragons in this game we haven't seen yet. Dragon Impact. What a move. Oh, this is this is like a pink horsey. Fair enough. Serpiro. Serpiro? I'm assuming this is a fire type, so Jeff's probably going to die here. But hey, Sir Pyro's a cool... Ow. Oh my god, that thing one-shot me. Droot! Oh my god, this is... This is the dragon type I want. I want Droot on my team. This is the one I was telling you guys about. This is who I want. That's the... I think I think Droot, he apparently comes from an egg. I think in this town or whatever. So like... I'm, I'm really wanting this egg. I don't know which egg he comes from, but I, I, just, I just really want him. Droot is amazing. He looks, he looks dope. It just occurred to me that Jeff is actually perfect for this gym or whatever because they're all dragon types and we now have a uh, evolved, a evolved Jeff. I'm, I'm excited. He's looking pretty, he's looking pretty cool. I must admit. I mean, he's really strong in his, in his base form. So I can't imagine as to what husk, huskold. I can't imagine as to how strong huskold is going to be. He looks dope, edgy. I like him. Oh hey, hello. Ah, you're the trainer, Megastone, aren't you? I battled a few minutes ago. Uh, he also had a Megastone. I think his name is Robbie. Ah, right. His name is Rodney. He was a tough opponent. He managed to defeat me. My brother hasn't come by yet. I think he's still training. But I don't think it will be enough. Uh, so you want me to teach you a Megastone Professor Pinewood gave you? All right, I'll tell you, but you have to battle me first. You should know I was trained by Rex to be his Castellian for his castle, which means I'm really strong. If you manage to beat me, I will give you something you need in order to use your Megastone. Okay, let's start a battle. I will show you how. Okay, cool. Let's do it. Oh, hell yeah. Let's go. She reminds me of Flannery. Castellian Lizzie. Findra. The hell is this all about? Um, He doesn't look very weak to ice. Yeah, it's neutral. He's definitely a water dragon. That's unfortunate. Cry Cryodra. Is she just like water dragon? Because if she is, then Jeff is useless here. Wait, oh, it's got a Mega Evolution. Are you kidding me? Okay, that thing's actually really cool looking. What? We're neutral against it. Ow. Okay, so that's a Dragon Ice type. Right, okay. Uh, I don't actually know of... I mean, I guess Fighting type works here. I kind of just chose some Pokemon randomly, and I guess I kind of got lucky here, because Rupert's actually super effective against the Mega. Hell yeah, get out of here. And Faye, you got... What's this? Oh, this looks like a... Is this a poison type? Oh, wait, no. I think this is a fairy type. Because it was weak to poison earlier. Yeah, cool. There we go. 
Defeat Lizzie. What a battle. You're full of energy. You really are a great trainer. Never thought I'd be defeated by two young trainers in a row. I believe you're strong enough to handle Mega Ablutions. Here, take this. And we got the Mega Ring. She just has those to just hand out, apparently. You've already a Mega Ring, too. He took one for another girl named Kira. I think he has a crush on her. Uh, if Rick can beat me, I will give him one, too. So your friends will all be really strong. If you want to battle me again, I'll be in the Rassic Castle. Bye. Okay. Well, that's epic. We got ourselves a uh, Mega Stone. Uh, so now we have Mega Evolution, apparently. Um, I guess... All there really is to do is to check out Mega Salislam. Is there a trainer in here I can battle? Yep, there is. Okay, let's try out Mega Salislam. Why not? It's probably going to die instantly, but screw it. Oh, press Z and we go Mega. Okay. Uh, Aqua Slam. Here we go. Mega Evolution. Oh my god. Okay, he gets darker and he's got cooler fins. Yo, he is out here. He is out here. He is out here. Jeez Louise. Okay, I like this. Uh... Droot. Oh, this is the dragon I want. Uh, let's check on him. Can we see his sprite? We can! Yo, he looks so sick. Yo, I love Mega Salaslam. He's got sheer force when he Mega Evolves. And his stats are looking... Looking a little insane, actually. Jeez Louise. I love Salaslam. I'm so glad we chose him. Oh, looks like our OP team just got even more OP. Oh, hey, look who it is. Oh, Axel, there you are. I heard you were battling Lizzie in the castle. Ah, uh, it's Mega Ring. You won the battle. Congratulations. We're working hard to understand the balance crystal and determine if it helps us stop Team Solar Lunar guys. Don't you worry. But there's a reason I wanted to speak with you. You're a massive trainer and you want to battle against Solar Commander with ease. And now you defeat Lizzie too. So here, a gift. Help you in battle against your Team Solar and Lunar too. As you know, I'm a dragon specialist. So I'd like. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. What egg do I pick? This isn't fair. All right, so apparently the, the Pokemon we want is inside of the green egg. Uh, oh, I'll wait here for you. Oh, hell yeah. So even if, okay, cool. Uh, we got saved by this other egg that we've got already. Uh, we should probably try and hatch this egg before the episode ends and then go get the green egg. I think the green egg will have Droot. Uh, the other dragons do look cool, but we've already got three out of the five dragon types. Because uh, the dragons are Dragon Fairy, Dragon Grass, Dragon... Uh, fire, dragon, water, and dragon electric. And we've already got electric, fire, and water. So we only really need fairy and grass. And I'd rather have the grass one than the fairy one. So that will be the final team member uh, once we once we get on our team. I just want to hatch this really quick. Oh, here we go. This egg's hatching. I think I already know what it is. I don't know why it took so long to hatch. Uh, yep. It's this little guy. We, we knew it was a guppish. Eh, fair enough. Well, let's go deposit it and get ourselves a green egg. Which I might actually run around a bunch off screen uh, before next episode, you know, just to try and get it hatched faster because I want it. I want to use it on my team as soon as possible. All right, let's take the green egg. Splendid. I think that one's perfect for you. Okay, I have to find Rodney. Give him an egg too. Good luck. Thank you. Just walk through my Pokemon, bro. What's the, po what's the problem? So now, just to be sure... Yes, this definitely, this definitely looks like it would be uh, Droot, so that's exciting. Anyways, um, with that, I believe that is where we're going to wrap this episode up. We discovered Mega Evolution, we got a bunch of story progression done, we got a new egg, which is going to be a new team member, obviously. So, of course, if you guys uh, enjoyed the video, then leave a like. If you're excited for episode 13, then uh, let me know in the comments, let me know who your favorite team member is, let me know what you think about the Mega Evolution, just let me know your thoughts in the comments. I do, I always love seeing what you guys have to say. Um, that's for now, though, I will get out of your hair. Really happy with Jeff's, out of Jeff's evolution, man. It turned out a lot cooler than I expected. Uh, anyhow, thanks so much for watching. See you guys next time. Bye-bye.